Hello and welcome. So today I'll be showing you how to configure the OB scoreboard on OBS and it's actually the same on uh, Wirecast, uh, vMix and pretty much any other streaming software to be honest. So you can change the name easily here by saying I don't know name one and name two. Uh, again you can obviously change the score, you can change the sport. So there is soccer and rugby at the moment. Now, if you only sign up for soccer rugby, the change sport button won't appear here. Um, again, you can add tries. Um, and you can get rid of them by right clicking. And same goes for yellow and red cards. And there's black cards for football as well. So left, or left click to increase, right click to decrease. You can generate a code. Uh, here so you can control the scoreboard with your phone if you go to obscoreboard.com slash controller on your phone or any other device tablet anything you can type this generated code into your phone half time uh, or the half lint uh, is set to 40 minutes here for rugby if you change it to football it'll, the default will be uh, 30 you can change that to 35 if you like here and it will change to 35 you can count up or down so if you change it to count down it will count down from 35 and if you change county up it'll count up to 35 once it reaches 35 it will change to red so for example if this is how you change the time so you can change it to just 30 or 35 uh, without going to the second or you can change it directly to the second so if you said 35 minutes and 58 seconds or 34 I mean uh, so if you go to 34 minutes and 58 seconds as it goes from 58 59 as it goes from 59 to the 35 min 35th minute it will change to red and that's the same no matter what the half length is so for 35 minutes or 45 minutes the scoreboard will go red just before that minute so then if I change time to 35 so example you're starting a new half it'll go back to its normal color but it's just when it goes from 34 minutes 59 seconds to 35 minutes it will change to red uh, you can add crests in as well by just clicking there i recommend a square image with a transparent background it doesn't matter what size it is obviously the higher quality the picture is the better and you can do the same here uh, you can change the scoreboard in so if we leave it at soccer there is you can change the colors here easily as well by just clicking on them um, you can change colors here by just clicking the background color and that's the same really for most of them you know you can't change the colors in this scoreboard but you can in this scoreboard by just clicking on the background and same goes for this if you want to change the background here if you want to change if you want to change the text color just click on whatever color you want and then click outside the color picker to close it and that's pretty much everything I have to show for today. Uh, so we're gonna constantly be adding new features, um, keep it as relevant as possible. We will probably add lower thirds in the coming weeks and months. And we also have plans to add more sports. So there will be baseball coming shortly enough as well. And there's also gonna be darts, um, cricket, and obviously basketball and other sports will come further down the line as well. Uh, we're basically doing by request as we're getting requested to do certain sports we will do our best to add them so thanks a million for watching i hope this video was of great benefit to you and hopefully ob scoreboard will be the scoreboard you'll choose thank you